Today's video, I'm going to show you the best blitz in Madden 24, and it comes to us out of the dollar three two. And the play we're going to be taking a look at today is free safety zone blitz. Now, the cool part about free safety zone blitz is it's in pretty much every single dollar defense, including the Kansas City Chiefs. Kansas City Chiefs is good for a lot of reasons. It's one of the better playbooks in the game because it has nickel three three, dime normal four three, even six one, all of that stuff. If you guys want to get my entire ebook on the Kansas City Chiefs defense, it is available by becoming a Patreon member. We've got dollar in there, three three, four three, even six one dime normal quarters normal everything you need to be successful defensively we actually are working on a brand new 335 odd scheme which is kind of tough um, so that's going to be out this week so make sure you're a patreon member ten dollars a month gets you access to everything that we do all of our offenses and defenses all of our updates to those ebooks and anything new that we do while you are a member you get immediate access to it all so if you want to become a better player the link to sign up for that is going to be down in the description below but we're going to be talking today about free safety zone blitz in the dollar three two now, the really cool part about this specific blitz is if you look here, the safety uh, actually runs down to the line of scrimmage at the snap of the ball. This can be very helpful for just getting your safeties into the box in general. So when we press coverage, notice that the safety on the left side is a little bit more um, towards the line of scrimmage than the one on the right side. This allows us to do different adjustments. For example, uh, we might want to put him in a deep half on the left side and then maybe put a cloud flat and a vertical hook over there on that side. For the setup for the blitz, all you're going to do is you're going to press your coverage, you're going to pinch your defensive line, and you're going to spread your linebackers. From there, what I like to do is we're going to stand about right in here, and we are going to get this pressure up the middle. Now, this blitz is not as good as it was post or pre-patch. That is important to understand, but it is still one of the best blitzes in the game. I actually think it is the best blitz in the game. And if we want to improve our odds at getting that A gap, we'll just blitz the slot corner. As you can see, when we blitz the slot corner, that guard gets manipulated by that concept and we're able to get the pressure up the middle. One of the underrated things that I think you can actually do with this, and I don't even know if it's going to work, but uh, let's go ahead and take this defensive lineman on the right and put him in a zone. Yeah, it didn't work as good as I wanted it to. Um, but the cool part about this defense is it's it's literally only sending a couple people at the quarterback, and you're able to get pressure. So that you can create all kinds of routes uh, or all kinds of zone concepts around this. Uh, the more we run this in practice mode, the more you're going to see that the four-man is good, but the five-man is great. And the five man is more, a little bit more consistent um, whenever they're sending their running back out. Now, when they block the running back, the cool part about the four man pressure, when they block their running back in this game, the four man pressure can still come in. So they can do different types of pass protection methods, right? But the cool part about this is a lot of times, even if they block the running back, sometimes you can, you can get that blitzer to loop through the middle and it can be a very, very good adjustment uh, for someone. And it just forces them to have to honestly like think for a second about pressure. Most people in this game, this game's so offensive. It's, it's, it's really the fact that we can get some, pre some level of pressure only sending three or four people makes this automatically one of the better blitzes in the game. Now, if we really wanted to send heat, then we would just blitz this slot corner. Now, when we send this, I normally like to, you know, kind of get down in here, especially for the five man. It's just going to make it a little bit easier for that, uh, that blitzer to come in. The other thing that I want to talk about real quick is you can also kind of be out here. Uh, and the cool part about this is it's going to create kind of almost like a crossfire uh, concept with your users. So I'm standing about right here. Um, and and I th it might actually be because the running back's running through the A-gap that this is getting picked up. It might be because I have an X-factor on Pacheco, even though it's pick artist. Um, you know, that might be, you know, I don't know. But anyways, uh, the cool part is, like I said, it's very good, especially if they – if they send five, if you send five and they send five out, you're going to get pressure no matter what they do. Uh, and so this is just a great way to force your opponent to have to block the running back. The other thing that makes us really, really good is the pressure is an overload. So like in this example, the bunches to the right. So the blitz, we have a lot of uh, coverage opportunities that we can do to the right. So we could go with an outside quarter. We could go with a middle third. We might man this guy up on the tight end. And then we can kind of create some really interesting roll coverages like this that are super, super effective for stopping things like verticals. And then all we have to basically do is user the slot receiver. 
So I love this blitz, free safety zone blitz, super effective little blitz defense. And if you really want the blitz to work, if you're, you know, if your four man is not working, go ahead and just send five. Um, you want to be mixing up, sending four, sending five throughout the game anyways. And this is, I think, the best way to be blitzing still post patch, uh, just because they're the, even the chance of that four man coming in uh, is super, super, super good. It's super effective. So I want to thank you guys for watching this video. If you want to get my entire dollar defensive ebook, the link is going to be down in the description. You can sign up for there. It gives you access to everything. We have a Kansas City, basically entire Kansas City chief scheme. We have dime normal. We have uh, three three. We have um, four three even six one. All of that stuff's in there. So thanks for watching the video, guys. And to sign up for the Patreon, head down to the description and click the link down below.